really dizzy. Oh, okay. Any other issues you're breathing in? You feel like you're breathing okay and stuff? Just maybe a little lightheaded? Mm -hmm. All right, let me take a look. I'm going to just check here real quick. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and um, have, get some other help in here real quick. Hi, can I get some help here? We're having a little bit of hemorrhaging going on. Don't be alarmed, we're going to be okay. Um, Patty, you're going to be fine. We're going to get our team in here and we'll get everything going to help help you feel a little better. Maybe not as light. Hey, I'm Dr. Dunes. Nice to meet you. So what's going on? So this is Patty. She delivered about 30 minutes ago. Okay. Um, the was intact. This is her fourth child. Um, right. Estimated blood loss around 400. Right. Um, but she is definitely having a little more hemorrhaging now. All right. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, what are vital signs? Vital signs 130 over 80. Um, um, all right. And how about a pulse? Uh, 105. Okay. How's she feeling? Is she dizzy and lightheaded? She said she was feeling really dizzy. Okay. All right. So um, did they say anything about the placenta at delivery? It was intact. Okay. All right. I'm just going to... How's my uterine time? Uterus is bottom. Okay, all right. So I'm going to take a look real quick You're just to see if there's any lacerations. So, any lacerations? No lacerations. Okay, okay. all right. So this is going to be a little uncomfortable. I'm just going to make sure there's nothing, no piece of placenta or anything. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, okay, all right. So do I feel anything? Um, minimal clot, but nothing really. Okay, all right. So keep breathing through it, Patty. You're going to be all right. right so, um, and how's my uterine time? Still bottom. Okay, so I, I think most likely that this is what's called atony, which means the uterus isn't contracting. So um, can you give some oxygen on her? Um, and uh, how's my, uh, so um, let's go to get the hemorrhage. Okay, okay. Uh, yep. I'm going to grab that real yeah, quick. Go ahead. I'm going okay. to keep massaging. 10 liters okay. on. Yep, sounds good. And uh, what's my vital signs? I've got updated vital signs. Pressure is 110 over 70. Pulse is 120. And the is up to 70. Can you start a second week for me? Okay, and yeah, let's, let's bring it fully back through. I mean, I haven't put it in yet, but let's just let's have it. Um, okay. Yeah. Right, so, uh, my patients, can we, uh, does she have any medical problems? She doesn't have any. Okay. All right. Um, let's give her, uh, let's give her some nitrogen. Okay. How much would you like? Uh, 0.2 milligrams. So let's give it I am. Okay. Okay. All right. So, we've got the IV going. I'm doing this. Um, okay. Methodism's been given. Okay. All right. Uh, She's still bleeding. Okay. All right. So, uh, what are my vital signs? Uh, vital signs. You don't have updated data set. Okay. All right. Um, how's she feeling? She just feels really sick. Really dizzy. Okay. Um, all right. So, can you go ahead and open up the foley? And mm -hmm. uh, do we have the hemovate in the heart? Yes. Okay. Should be okay. Yeah. No. We're just trying to make sure that her ears not bend down because they can all stop the bleeding. Mm -hmm. So um, can we do that? Can we do labs as well? Yeah, let's do a, a CBC, PT, PTT, uh, an INR. All right, and actually, let's, uh, let's hold up on the foil. Let's, go, let's put the medicine first. Okay. okay. IVN, okay. labs drawn, and then we right. can do that for me. Your blood loss is up to 1,000. Okay. Heart rate is 125. Pressure, 190 over 65. Or 90 over 65. Okay. So let's give her um, Let's go ahead and give her the hemovate. Okay. So, How much? Uh, 0.25 milligrams IM. Okay. So let's, yeah, let's just go ahead and put that in. Okay. All right. All right. So um, hemovate has been given. All right, good. All right. So uh, hang in there, Patty. We're getting you. We're getting you taken care of. Don't right, worry. So how's, how's my bleeding doing? Uh, bleeding is unchanged. She still feels boggy. Okay. How are you feeling? All right. About the uh, same. Okay. All right. All right. So we've got an IV in. I guess mm -hmm. there's just any lacerations. We, uh, I don't think there's anything retained. We've done uh, medication. We've done two medications. Um, you said she didn't have any medical problems? No, she okay. didn't have any. Alright. Um, uh, anyway, we should probably, let's go ahead and just call anesthesia just to kind of have them okay. up. So just call for them. Uh, Can we get anesthesia in here? Um, Please. All right. She needs surgery? No, no, no not yet. Yeah. She's, she's doing okay. Um, but we really do need to get this to stop. Okay, so, you know, another thing we do is, um, I, I know it's on the heart bank, but um, we can order some TXA. Okay. So uh, let's get that ordered. And uh, is she still bleeding? She is. She's up to 1.5 1. 1. liters. Okay. Pulse is 140. So the pressure is 80 over 60. Okay. So another thing we do, let's get a let's get a balloon. Okay. Let's get an intruder balloon. I'm right. so gonna go grab the balloon. I'll start TXA okay. so, out there. So we're gonna um, we're gonna put a, it's a balloon inside. It's, what it's gonna do is gonna put pressure on from the inside to hopefully stop the bleeding. Um, I'm not very comfortable, but it's going to help me help stop the bleeding. Okay. All right, so I'm going to help you. Okay, so put this together. So I'm going to take this part. Uh, this is. Uh, what they're doing now is they're just prepping the balloon. They're going to insert the balloon into the uterus, and as they deliver the fluids into the balloon, it'll expand and help.
help the uterus Psychopath. contract so that the bleeding doesn't continue. All right, and then can you give me the syringe? Yeah, hook this up. Let's make sure we don't make this. All right. All right. So there's still just prepping all this stuff, so just hang in there. So I'm going to do this just to see if I get So listen, I apologize, I'm just going to be a little uncomfortable. Um, so we call it anesthesia, right? Yes, anesthesia is okay. All right, so, so I'm going to apologize, it's going to be a little uncomfortable. All right, I'm just going to put this in. All right, I've got it up. You're doing great, Patty. Into the uterus. Okay, so I see what, um, I'm going to have to hold this so mm -hmm. if you can take this off, should yep. pull it back. Good, let it fill up. Good. Mm -hmm. Let's just go and push that in. There you go. Good. All right, so we're doing okay. So what we're doing is we're putting fluid in, we're blowing up the balloon just to, to give us some pressure. Okay, let's do it again. Okay, so that's one. So that should be, based on this, that I just said, I mean, that should be 15. Mm -hmm. All right, good. Doing great, okay. All right, so we're going to another 50 up, let's go. So, um, all right, so it feels like it's in the right place. Good. Um, we can go up to 500. I'll okay. we'll have to go to 300. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Okay. All right, hang in there. All right, I know it's uncomfortable. You're doing a good job. 50. Right. Delivering it. Yeah, good. Um, actually, I'm going to hold that to your lap. Then I'm going to pack when we get done. I'm putting this in because our sugar is still pretty dilated. It's four, so this is going to be 200. All right, so we're 200, good. All right, so it's in the right place. It's still filling up. That's good. All right, how's our bleeding? Uh, bleeding is starting to slow. Okay, all right, so let's go ahead and let's get another, get another 100 in at least, and then we'll see where we are. Okay. All right, and then... This is going to be 250? This is still my vital signs. This is going to be 60, okay. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. Mm -hmm. Then we get 250, good. Yes, 250. All right, all right keep going. Okay, when this is delivered, this will be 300. Okay. All right, so, um, all right, so uh, how's my, so wait, 300, how's my bleeding doing? The bleeding is going to stop at this point. Okay, all right, so, so can you just give me a scan? Yeah, okay. So I'm going to, I'm going to take this, I'm actually going to pack, just to, um, just helps hold it in place. Yeah, we don't want it to come out. All right, so, um, all right, so I have updated vital signs for you now. Okay. Looks like or with the bleeding under control, her pulse is down to 105, pressure has come back up. Okay, awesome. It's right. not bleeding anymore? No, no. So, so the good news is it stops. So, um, so I, I think her issue was, is um, I'm going to leave this in. So we're going we're gonna to take this here, we're going to leave it in place. Okay. All right. Um, so I, I think what it was is her uterus just didn't want to clamp down. Um, so it gets boggy and it bleeds. And so we, we tried all the medications. Um, and it didn't stop. So what we did is we put a balloon in and just kind of push pressure. So it's good. She's doing well. Um, we're going to leave this in for about 24 hours. Um, and we'll watch and make sure that she's doing okay. We're going to check her labs and, and, uh, and we'll take care of her. And we'll, we'll, we'll see how she's doing. But, but this is good right now. Okay. Thank okay. You. All right. We're done here. Good work, everybody.